Hello, this is a video game hunter, and welcome to another BGH Let's Play. And today, I'm gonna be doing a let's play on a game that I was a back on called Yoko Lele. Now, this is not the official game that will be coming out like much later this year or next year. I kind of forgot which year supposed to be coming out, but. But since I became a backer for this project, they sent me a um, Steam key to try out their Yoko Lele toy box. And I'm not 100% sure what this is. This could be a short test game for me to try out and give my opinion to the world or to the company at least. But I thought it would be pretty. I thought it would be pretty neat if I do a let's play on this and see what this game is all about. Oh, what this toy box is all about. I don't know what I'm not really sure what this is, but let's give it a go. <laughs> uh, what a terrible intro that was, but we're gonna keep on moving. Reminds me of um, Banjo Kazooie, which is of course by me by the same developers, really. <laughs> Never did care for Banzo Kazooie. I thought that game was too slow, which I could never get into. So it's going to be released in the first quarter of 2017. Okay, so it'll be released next year then. Buzz! What was that noise? Show yourself. Um, okay. Step, step closer. Move with the stick and jump with A. Okay, so let's see what this game is all about. Okay. Huh. Whoa. <laughs> so far, this is so much better than Banjo Kazooie. Like, r literally right away. I forgot what a sandbox is, but whatever. But so far, I do like the fact they try to keep it to like the original Banzo Kazooie. Not really voice acting, which I don't think there was any voice acting. It was just them making noises, which is what this game is continuing doing. <laughs> Meet B might use a number of jumping and attacking moves in this test area. More in the final game, okay? Traverse, make organic feeling. Collect all 100 quills for a moderate reward. It's what you DNA bags would like to call it. Right, old lock? Okay. Access granted. Press switch to enter. Um, okay. Press switch to end. Okay, that's a button, but whatever. Go on, then. I haven't got all day. Jump with A and press. Looks like a, that's a left trigger. Well, uh, in the air to ground smash, okay? Um, that's kind of odd using a trigger for something to ground smash, but whatever. Alright. Kind of looks like Minecraft a little bit. I think Minecraft is called a sandbox, right? Yeah, I think it is. So, a uh, sandbox is something like Minecraft that you get to create stuff. Huh, maybe I can create stuff and there's a little demo here. Bug detected. Please tell them they messed up. Okay. Nothing to do with me. Alright, I'm supposed to be a security bot anyway. What do I know about tutorials? I don't know, you're a robot. Hopefully they programmed you right so I can learn from you so I can know how to play this game. <laughs> Alright, so... Okay, so it's double jump is to glide. 
What is that? An ice cream cone? Let's see what this is. No, that is feathers. Why the hell would I be collecting feathers? Okay. I am a okay, a quill, which is basically a feather. Well, it pretend be your one. Collect 100 of us and receive a pagey. Okay. I will. Let's let's see if I can collect all 100 of these things. <laughs> I, I, I like the sounds they make. Um, but why camera? I don't know if I'm used to the cameras. I don't think there'll be no reasons to invert the camera. <laughs> Windows 10 plus extra Xbox One control. Nope. Microsoft still hasn't sent me my Windows 10, so won't be selecting that. Music volume effect. Okay, everything seems fine. If I want to mess with the volume, I must just use my keyboard right here. Okay. Okay, that's that's one way to go fast. All right. Oh, okay. Let's let's do the rolling move. Yeah, see that works perfectly. Yeah, this is. Yeah, I can see this game being fantastic when it gets done. This is definitely far superior than the original Banzo Kazooie. <laughs> I wish I could say, say more about Banzo Kazooie, but I only played that game like a couple of times and could not get into it. But this, this is so much better. Ah! Oh, no, I fell down! If your sewer water will affect your second layer, I'll tell you how to swim. Press A to rise and B to sink. Oh, that's A to rise and X to sink. Then move with joystick. Okay. Now, let's try to do that again. Wow, I can't believe how well the controls are. Yeah, this is perfect. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I fell down. Oh, not... Oh, but I slid down. Oh, oh. Okay, yeah, there we go. Cool. Yeah, they they thought everything out with this game. Oh, oh, oh! I fell down. Okay. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Okay. It's, it's not the controls fault, it's my fault. Okay. Uh, trying to fight. Now it's a con now is the controls fault. I'm trying to. I'm fighting the cameras a bit. Oh no, I fell down again. Oh, see, that time it's the camera's fault. It, it kind of locks in a little bit when I get there. Hopefully, that will get fixed when this game comes out. Oh wait, I got. Okay, I did not get the feather. Okay, let's try. Go. Let's try. Let's try. I'm, right now, I'm having camera issues a bit. Oh right, we made it. We made it to top. What's in the treasure? Can I open it? Yeah, two more feathers or oh, quills. All right, Nito. Looks like a ball. Maybe I, maybe I should push it. Oh, sh ow! Oh man, you mean I have to go all the way back to the top? That freaking sucks. All right. Okay, jump and jump. No. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh, I did that. I don't know what's going. I don't know if I need that bar later or oh. not. All right. So my next guess is I'm going over there. Can I see some quills? All right. Oh shit. Or let's not. Let's let's go swimming underwater. See what we find. 
<laughs> so yeah, I don't think... I don't think he can drown. I don't see any meter saying I need air or anything, so... Oh, right, let's go it up! Uppity, 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 up, up! Alright, let's get out let's get out of that water. Now let's try and go somewhere else. Alright. I don't like the fact that I have to jump in the treasure chest to get the item. I wish I can just open it and it the item just jump to me or he just lifts the items like he does in Legend of Zelda. I don't know, I just don't I think it's, it just looks silly when the character says jump into the treasure chest. Come on. Oh uh, shit. Come on. You got it. You almost have it. Okay, it's up there. Maybe we have to put this ball in this hole? No, don't fall off the edge. Fall in there. There you go. Yeah! Oh, alright. So there was a reason why I need to burst that ball off of that cliff. Okay. Nice. Okay, so. That is done. Let's go over there. Yeah, so far this game is not too bad. The controls, it's pretty well done. It is alright. And the only my only complaint so far is the camera angle. I mean, right now it's fine, but when I get to certain points of the ledge and stuff, it kind of um, locks in a little bit, and I have to fight it a bit. Oh, and, and I think the bat wants me to go. It's biting me, so. I wonder, can I get hurt? Can I hurt myself if I fall down? Nope. Now there's a chance he might add that in the later game, or when the game comes out. But for now, I I don't get hurt, and hopefully I don't have to get hurt when the game gets out. Then that would kind of suck. I just recently um got done playing Conquer's Bad Fur Day on the N64, and I hated the fact that um uh, when I fall off the edge, I get hurt, which is not a bad thing. But sometimes you fall off the ledge and you don't think it was all that high, and yet I lose like half my health. If not, it kills me for the oddest reasons. So if they do, so if it does hurt me when I fall off the edge when the game gets released, um, hopefully it's at a reasonable height. If not, then I might be dying a lot. <laughs> Fell off again. I might be dying a lot when the game comes out. You know what? If this game succeeds, I would love to see a um, updated version of Conquest Bad Fur Day. Probably not from this company, but at least do a um a spiritual successor to it. Ain't there like a door? Cause I'm pretty sure I saw a door or a cave. Yeah, ain't that it? Yeah, that's it. Let's go in there. Oh, right, it takes me to the other side of the map. Oh, did it? No, it took me to that floating island, I believe. And there's a ghost. Can I attack you? I don't know, you're not messing with me. I mean, you're making fun of me, but... Okay, it it, it kind of lags right there. kind of drops some frames. Uh, I wonder why. It's just at that one spot of the game. Who knows? Alright. Alright, it's 41. Okay, I don't know why. Can I destroy those? Yes, I can. Eh. I can still jump on it after it got destroyed. Nice. 
Oh, damn, I fell right through that crack. Okay. Yeah, it's there's no way shape and form why it should be rolling like that. All right, let's jump a little bit higher. Oh, oh, damn, damn, damn. Always, oh, I fell right through those, between the level ledge again. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Come on, get up there. I, f I fucking hate that box. I'm telling you that now, I freaking hate that box. No way, shape, or form should it be rolling like that. It's bad physics. Bad developers. Bad. Alright. What's up with this red thing? Um, apparently it hurts me. Okay. I'm not supposed to be running into those, apparently. I'm supposed to be dodging them. Alright. Now we can go in there. What's in... I can't see. There we go. What to say? I thought the game messed up on me. What is that supposed to be? That's some kind of light. That's water. What is the purpose of this part? Um, okay. I failed to see a purpose at this part, but whatever. Oh wait, what was that? Oh, so we haven't gone up there yet. Let's do it then. Let's see if we can go up there. Oh. Oh, we found more feathers. Th there we go. As long as there's no sharks here, we should be good. Oh, there's more over there. Oh, let's go get those instead before I move any further. Uh oh. See, now I'm finding the camera again. Sixty, forty more to go. There are more over there. But I haven't gone over there yet. Okay, I basically know, I think I pretty much know where all they are now. Well, I know where everything is, pretty much. Okay. So I might just go ahead and do the whole 100 thing then. Oh, the frame rate really dropped right there. Alright, so we found two places where the frame rate will really drop. What? What? I think there's an invisible wall right here. 
Yeah! Oh no, wait! Nah, it's glass. A very, very clear glass when you go under the glass. <laughs> Alright. Oh, and this is not. Okay, now it's slippery. Oh, overhead view, puzzle. Nice. Kind of like a maze. Alright, that makes it 70. No, it wasn't a tough puzzle. I'm sure it'll be a much difficult one once this game gets released. Alright, that's 72. Um, 28 more to go. Greetings, user. You haven't seen any other organics around. Here, have you... It's so difficult to satisfy the urge to exterminate in this empty simulation. Anyway, what did you think of the different camera leading up to the this point? Do you have a favorite? I'm advised Meek Bean can disguise feedback on Platonic Forms at ForumsPlatonic.com. Do you have it, folks? Um, if you have any opinions of my Let's Plays... Oh, actually, if you have any opinions by watching my Let's Play about this game, go to that website they just mentioned. And join the forums. And no, I am not getting paid to say that. Yeah, apparently people people from YouTube are getting busted for not um, clarifying that they are getting paid to make videos. I am getting paid to make videos, but I am but this company is not paying me to show you this demo. Miss, make that very clear. They are not paying me to make this video. No, I did not think about anything about the music, but I will say this, the music, it's pretty good. It's, it's very calming. It makes me want to go on an adventure on my own while listening to this music. Oh, it looks like I missed a quill. I got it now. Yeah, the frame rates are dropping now. Wow, it is really dropping like to the 15s. Alright, 79. Alright, that's 80. 81 82 83 Looks like I got all of them from this part of the area Oh wow, I'm not ready to go over there Now I am Are you kidding me? Oh, oh, okay, I see now. I was about to do something very stupid. I was about to fly around that corner. But I didn't do that. Oh, that's 87? Yeah, it's a good thing I didn't do it because there's no ledges over there. I don't know. I don't think I've been over there, haven't I? Let's see what's fly over there. Oh, shit! I thought I can I can close almost falling off that ledge. Okay, what is that? Looks like a goblin. Let's go after it. Did 
There's a short on his head. Wow. Alright, so the whipping is not too bad. Oh, do I get anything? I don't know, let's try I won't probably want to go in let's go inside and see what happens. Oh, they're all in glass. Oh. Well, that doesn't work. Okay. I don't think I have no reason to be in here, to be honest. Silly little creatures. But at least the okay lady attacks like Crash Bandicoot, so it's not that difficult to attack your enemies. Oh, I believe I can slide down here. If the camera doesn't mess up on me. Ah. Yep, okay, that's 88 quills. Oh, what do we have here? Oh! Alright, we got eight more to go. Alright, so it's four more to go. And it's probably up there. Ah! You bastards! And that's all of them! Yes, I got all 100! Well done, user. You collect all quills, quota. Classic. Come find me to collect your pagey. Okay. Okay, but before we go and collect that page, let's hurry up and um, see what's in that door that we just unlocked. Alright, what's in here? Only one way to find out. Um... Maybe you can tell me what what's this, what is this place? What do I do here? Did you know robots really enjoy particle effects? Um. Okay. Okay. Um. So yeah, th there's really no reason for this to be here except showing off some effects that might be in the game once it's finished. Um, it's just kind of like those monsters that we just fought that we went inside and there were more monsters but they were in those glass cubes. I think they're just showing off what, what might be in the game once it's finished. Okay, but what's up with the bubble? I guess I can't expect some bubbles <laughs> when the game is completed. Alright, so let's go and get my prize, shall we? And I guess that will be it! <laughs> no, let's fall off the edge and see what happens. Oh, that was a lot faster. And we got the page! Greetings, user. I have a secret for you. Alright, and I guess all I have to do is hit that button. Psst. Ooh, what was that? I don't know, but we're gonna find out. But Seriously, I gotta go search for that button now? Found it. 
Took took me a while. I wonder what that is. Good question. Oh wow, a skeleton. We found something. It's a flashlight. Oh. No, it's not a flashlight. <laughs> it's a torch. When the real game comes out, we have to go to the pirate ship and smash the rock. Okay, I think. A, you'll find a surprise near a pirate ship. Ground, smash the lone rock under a nearby tree to reveal the way. Um, okay. And this is when the full fledged game comes out. Yeah, so. We don't know what the secret is, but yeah, so we have to wait until the full fledged game and figure out what this whole secret is all about. But anyway, thank you for watching my Let's Play on this Yoko Lady Toy Box Edition. Um, as my final thoughts on this game, it's so far I can say this game is far superior than um than Banzo Kazooie. I did not like Banzo Kazooie because it was slow and I didn't like the controls and whatnot. But everything what I play today is so much an improvement, which is what I was hoping for. And plus, they had no excuse not to because Banjo Kazooie literally came out about what 18 years ago, and 18 years ago that game was I consider to be very slow. Right now, I would say this: this beats Banjo Kazooie all the way. I like the music, I like the sounds the characters make, and the robots in the menu. Uh, uh. <laughs> uh. Yeah. So, I am very looking forward to this, um, for the full release of this game. Like I said, this one is going to be surpassing Banjo Kazooie. I guarantee it. I guarantee it. I'm pretty sure this game will not turn out like a Mighty Number no. 9. I haven't played that game, but for what I've seen and heard about the game and video evidence, the game looks like it sucks. Oh, well, I guess it's better than nothing, but anyway. So I really have nothing else to say. I am very, I am very impressed with this game. I'm glad I became a backer to this game. So I guess that is it. This is the Video Game Hunter. And until next time, goodbye. Thank you for watching my video. Please give it a like and subscribe for more videos. You can also follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Twitch, and even Art. If you have some free time on your hands, please check out the console explosion and other features on the site. Well, again, until next time, goodbye.